Hi, I'm Dr. MLE Wellness Witch, and this is my Royal Advice Tarot Spread. I uh, created this spread for the really significant crossroads in your life um, when the scenario is totally out of your control and you need to call on some really wise, really powerful guys. So step one, get a tarot deck with a really strong personality. I'm using Christy C. Rhodes Next World Tarot, um, which is a really revolutionary, badass deck um, that's gonna galvanize me, but also give me a swift kick in the pants. As you shuffle the deck, exchange some energy with the cards, make sure to get them really evenly distributed because the second step is to place the deck down, face down, and then flip one card over at a time. Removing the first king, queen, knight, and page that you flip. All right, so I'm looking solely for royalty as I flip these cards over. It's a really gorgeous deck, so I'll make sure. Okay, so I got the Knight of Pentacles. So I'm gonna put that one to the side. So now I'm looking for queens, kings, and pages. All right, page of swords, awesome. Although also, given what I've got going on in my life, the particular crossroads I'm at, uh, you know, swords is on par, on brand, but not necessarily <laughs> where I would have remained. All right, Queen of Wands. Woohoo, I love her. I like to think of her as um, the witch of the tarot. Uh, she doesn't make magic, she receives magic, which is truly badass. And now I'm going for big money, big money with this king. <laughs> And the only suit I don't have is the King of is Cups, so that might be a nice, um, nice card to draw. Though I'm really going for the King of Pentacles because I would like some stability in my life. But I got the King of Wands. All right, so as you lay these four cards out, you can think about them in both directions. So the page the Page of Swords, this is learn what I need or am or want or maybe want to try to learn. The Knight is the card of action or doing. So this is something really concrete that I may be already doing, might consider doing, or again, like could maybe shift course, particularly with this card a little bit if I start doing that. The Queen is the nurturing card. So something to nurture um, in my life, right? To, again, sort of manifest the outcome that I'm hoping for, that I feel like would be my best outcome in this dire scenario. And then the final card, the king, is mastery. Um, so this is the real um, growth edge, the steep learning curve, um, we could think of, you know, if this is a process, this is um, the outcome of that process where I want to land. Again, you know, because life, time, everything is not in fact linear, that's an illusion, it's actually spiralic. I wanna encourage y'all to also read the cards in the opposite order. So here's maybe something that I've already mastered, maybe a place that's a little bit static. We also always think that um, with the Kings that this is a gift to share, right? Because we have mastered it. It's time to be generous whenever, especially, well, with anything, right? The queen, again, so maybe this is, if I go backwards, I've already mastered something, I have a gift. How can I use it to nurture others? There we go, there's the queen. Um, the knight then, what can I do? I'm nurturing others. I think that knights are, you know, queens are very selfless. Knights are very selfish. So what can I now do maybe for myself specifically in this moment? And then again, the page is 
what, where can I, you know, and get nerdy? Where can I invest some time um, to start to grow a new skill set that I don't already have to kickstart that cycle again? So I really want to emphasize that the Royal Advice Spread is a continuum and that we are shuttling back and forth. And of course, there's lots of ways as tarot readers we can get super nerdy about this um, as we, you know, think about the distribution of the different suits. I've got swords, pentacles, right? So something about communication, um, something about, you know, that real kind of like gritty earth work, right? Getting in the soil, gardening, planting roots, that kind of thing. And then with the queen of wands, who just doesn't want to come in focus, and the king of wands, um, you know, I'm thinking about energy how energy moves untapped potential. Um, so that's all for now, folks. Uh, I invite you to get your hands on this badass Next World Tarot Deck by Christy Ski Rhodes and to check back in for my next badass revolutionary tarot spread. Thanks, y'all. See you next time.